Hey, uh, Cowboy fans, y'all need to relax. Y'all, I keep seeing these analysts. First off, I should say the analysts should relax too. I can't expect the, the Cowboys fan base to relax because that is that's not gonna happen. But um, analysts, I see out here talking about the Dallas Cowboys, and their defense, and and the plays that they're making is phenomenal. You know what? I don't disagree with that. Now, you got to play the teams on your schedule. But let's just be honest here. Dallas Cowboys haven't really beat anybody. Go ahead. Tell me who they beat. Are you over there getting arguing right now trying to talk about that they're 11-4? Let me go ahead and give you some statistics. Because men lie, women lie, number don't. The Cowboys have won six games. That means they 6-0 in their conference. In their NFC least, they're 6-0. So that's more than half their games right there because they've won 11, okay? That's more than half. So they beaten the Patriots. I'll give you that. The Patriots are a good team. However, when they beat the Patriots, the Patriots hadn't hit their winning streak yet. And their defense wasn't balling yet. But you guys won that game. And you guys beaten the Chargers. I'll give you that. That was a good quality win. You beat the fucking Chargers. But the Chargers, you know, they have a tendency to not play well. They just lost to Houston. I mean, this is a league of parody. Just like seems like everybody's losing. Hold on, time out. Wait a minute. You guys beat Carolina? Is Carolina going to the playoffs? I think not. You guys lost to the Las Vegas Raiders. Did we forget about that? A team that's on the cusp of making the playoffs, but probably won't make the playoffs. You lost to them, right? Mm -hmm. Um, you lost to Tampa Bay. Who? Oh, wait a minute. Are they going to the playoffs? I think so. You guys lost to them, right? Okay, that's that's two losses right there. What else did you guys lose to? Huh. You lost to Tampa Bay. You lost to the Raiders. Who else have you guys lost to? You had two more losses. I can't find I can't think of these two losses. But you guys lost. But you got and then the other wins that you got, you got wins versus Minnesota. Is Minnesota very good? I don't think so. Kurt, my not favorite cousins, is he's alright. I mean he's not great. I mean, but you guys got this dude souped up like he's actually pretty good. He's okay. I mean, Minnesota's not going anywhere. So, you guys beat Minnesota. You beat Carolina. Sam Darnold. Mm, stop it. Sam Donald Duck. No, he's trash. So, who have you guys beaten of a quality win? I'll give you guys New England. I'll give you that. I'm not giving you anything in your conference. So, more than half your wins came from that weak-ass conference. So, how many playoff teams have you actually played? Play Tampa. You lost. You haven't played the 49ers. who probably make the playoffs. You haven't played the Rams. You're about to play Arizona. We'll see what you do against Arizona. If you beat Arizona, which has been losing, so you should, probably should beat them. They've been struggling. If you beat Arizona, then come talk to me. But until then, chill out, man. Like, y'all haven't done anything spectacular. Yes, your defense has played phenomenal, but it also helps when you play a guy named Tyler Heineke or Hanning or whatever his name is. You, you want credit for that? Who, who else have you guys played? Who's else? Who, you big guys beat. Uh, uh, Daniel Jones list Giants. They didn't have Daniel Jones. They had who's their quarterback? Back quarterback, super long neck guy. I don't know his name. He's not very good. I can't even remember his name. He's not very good. You want credit for that? Stop. Who else is in that cover? Oh, you beat the Eagles. Yeah, I, I like Jalen Hurts. You know he. He plays in spurts. He plays really good. He does what he needs to do to win the game. Stats are so-so. He'll have a couple rushing touchdowns. When the Eagles can run the ball, they do phenomenal. But when he's actually trying to actually throw the ball down the field consistently, no, nah, it's not happening. <coughs> Eagles, they're a middle-of-the-road team, okay? You guys should be the Eagles. Sorry, you should. But you, it'll be a game because you guys are very good. Cowboys, you guys are B-plus team. I'll give B plus. But you guys are going to lose in the first round of the playoffs. If you have to play the 49ers, you play the Rams, play any of those teams, you guys are going to lose. More than likely, you'll probably end up playing like a low tier team because you'll be in conference. You have a home game because you won your division, which is ass. So, congratulations on winning the ass division. You'll probably get an ass trophy. An actual trophy of an ass is probably what you win for the NFC least. But whatever. Hey. I'm a Lions fan, so I guess I'm better. But it doesn't matter. You guys aren't going to the Super Bowl. I can guarantee that. And anybody wants to jump in the comments, let me know who you think is going to go to the Super Bowl. Let me know if you think the Cowboys are going to actually get past the first round. 
Okay. So first question one: Do you think? No, fuck that. How about this? Do you think the Cowboys are gonna get past the first round? And if you don't think they gonna get past the first round, don't even worry about the Super Bowl question because that's irrelevant because you already know they're not going very far. Fuck the Super Bowl. Do you think the Lions? Do you think the Cowboys are gonna get past the first round? Tell me. Do you think they're gonna get past the first round? I don't. I think they're gonna lose at home, and it's gonna be such. It's, your, your tears, Cowboys, Cowboys fans, your tears taste like sugar. I love it. I love it. Hot fucking hells. Come on, no, come get your hell. You guys are. You guys make me laugh. I haven't been relevant in 25 years, but you talking like you won the Super Bowl last year. Stop the cap, cappers. We're capping means we're lying very much out here strong exaggerations that, you know, that Prescott had been playing well, but he had a phenomenal game versus the Washington football team. You So you want to celebrate a win about beating a team that does not have a nickname. Think about that. That really doesn't have a starting quarterback. They have a backup that has to start because they don't have anybody else. You want credit for that? They're on our schedule. Yeah, they are on your schedule. But it's one thing to say we beat the teams on our schedule. True. But we got to see what we can do against some actually good teams. But to just talk about this, I hate when y'all just jump from we're a decent team to straight to Super Bowl. Whereas the Miami Dolphins, which I don't think is going to win the Super Bowl, have won, I don't know, seven straight games. Now, they haven't beat anybody. Granted, they haven't. But, they, you know, they beat the team that was in front of them. But I don't think the Dolphins are going to the fucking Super Bowl because they beat these sorry-ass teams. But so why the fuck should I think the Cowboys are going to go to the Super Bowl? Well, they have a better team than the Dolphins. Yeah, I know that. But they're not. They haven't played anybody. So do we really know how really, how do we know how good the Cowboys really are? Or do we just like, you know, it's the Cowboys. Because we just love the Cowboys. We love the Cowboys. Or we love to hate the Cowboys. They're just controversial, so we like to talk about them. So are they really that good or is it just, you know, easy to talk about? Tell me. Let me know in the comments. Are the Cowboys really that good? Do you think the Cowboys are really that good? Do you think they can beat a really good team? Do you think they can do you do you think they're going to get, get the number one seed. Let me know in the comments. Do you think they're going to get the number one seed? I don't. I think the number one seed is going to go to, right now, you have Green Bay. Green Bay has, I think they got, I don't know who their next game is, but it doesn't matter. They're going to win. Then they play the Lions, which I'm a Lions fan. They're going to beat the Lions. It'll actually be competitive, but the Lions will throw an interception or do something. They'll do Lions things. I, I or they'll do something to lose because the Lions – they find new ways to lose. It's actually remarkable. I've never seen a team do such a thing. But we did get our two wins and our ties that we're taking. Um, we're not beating the Green Bay Packers. So Green Bay is going to be the one seed. Dallas, I think you'll get, you'll get the two seed. You should get the two seed. But you might stumble to the Eagles. No, fuck that. You're going to lose to Arizona because you can't beat a good team. I forgot. So let me know in the comments. What do you think? Do you think the Dallas Cowboys will get the first seed? Do you think the Dallas Cowboys will win in the first round? And for some of you, do you think the Cowboys are actually make the Super Bowl? Let me know in the comments. It's the same V by AB. I got another video coming up soon. Please subscribe, share, like this video and other videos. Also do music. Let me know what you think. If you think it's trash, just say, hey, I think it's trash. That's fine. It's not trash because I know people put take the time to put that as trash they're actually trash individuals because you can be doing something um for yourself and actually creating your own business and i tell you this if you post a video about anything i'm sure it's going to be trash and i'll be so if you want to call my shit trash definitely i want you to post a video too so i can get on your page and actually see if your shit is good because if it's actually good i won't just reply because it's trash you call my shit trash i just be like hey this is actually pretty good considering that you call my shit trash but if it's trash i'm gonna call it trash so just be ready I'm going to call it trash if it's trash. You can call this trash. You do what you do. It doesn't matter. Fuck you. Or plan traffic. That's what I say. So, signing off. Safety by AB. Again, the Cowboys aren't like that. Stop pumping these guys. The Cowboys blasphemy. Blasphemy is just, I can't take it anymore. It's sickening. It's all over TV. And it's a narrative that needs to die. Thank you.